They tell you everything happens for a reason. They tell you to make every second count. They tell you that your life is in your hands. People will tell you a lot of things that aren't true. Like when they told me she hadn't felt any pain. Vanessa played the violin. She would hold the bow in her hands and make magic, and I would listen. Sometimes I would play along with her, both of us working together to fill the empty spaces. Music did that for us. It fixed things. But it can't fix this. It can't bring her back. The guy was drunk. He said he didn't even see her. That's crap. I know he did. It wasn't even dark, Ian. There's no way he could have seen the car in front of him. It doesn't matter. What do you mean it doesn't matter? My sister, your girlfriend, is dead. And you say it doesn't matter? It doesn't matter how it happened. Vanessa could have been hit by a truck, struck by lightning. She could have even had cancer. But it doesn't matter. She's still gone. Yeah. Maybe. She loved you, you know. You think so? It was pretty obvious. I think it was the piano that won her over. She really liked hearing you play. I liked it when she listened. Do you really think Vanessa's gone? You won't like my answer. Try me. I can't think of where else she'd be. I'd like to, but I don't know where else there is for her to go. Maybe, but she has to be listening. Wherever she is, just has to be listening. Hey, Ian. I haven't seen you around. How's, uh, everything? Hey, Anna. You don't have to be so careful around me. I I'm fine. Sorry, I was just trying to... Look, it, it doesn't really even matter. Words can't make a difference. But maybe music can. What's that supposed to mean? The funeral's in a few days, and I know Vanessa isn't here now, but maybe she can still hear me play. And maybe if I write a song for the funeral, it could be a way to send her off, you know? You know, I've known you for a long time, Ian, and I like to think I know you pretty well, but it seems like a big challenge, even for you. It's just that you've always been so particular about your music, and it's never going to be perfect. You're always going to want to make it an improvement. Look, Anna, you didn't know her like I did. Music was everything to her, and who would I be if I couldn't give that to her now? You're right, Ian. I don't know. I don't, okay? It's just... You've never done anything like this before. I think it'd be better to just leave well enough alone. No, I can't do that. If there's a song out there that she wants to hear, then I have to write it. I just hope you know what you're doing. That's the thing about music. You don't always have to know. Sometimes you just have to play. Bye, Anna. Hours passed this way. The song was like a love letter in my head, each chord a word I wanted to write down. But every time I thought I had something, the doubt would creep in. I would convince myself that it wasn't good enough, that it wasn't perfect, and I believed myself. Ian, I told you this was going to happen. This song is never going to be exactly what you want. I know, I know. I just... I thought it'd be easier. I thought everything would just come to me or something. What is this really about? What? You know, this obsession. 
Is this really about her? About Vanessa? Or is it about you? Look, I know moving on is hard, and you maybe think that you owe her something, but nothing that happened was your fault, Ian. And locking yourself in that room, slaving over the piano? It's not going to help anyone. It's not going to help Vanessa. And it's not going to help you. I just don't know what to do. I don't know how to move on. Well, maybe that's all you do. Maybe she knows that this is how hard you tried and that's enough. Are you saying I should just give up? No, I'm saying that your concert's over. And that's okay. No one gets to choose what happens in this world. Everything comes and goes without your warning, without your consent. But when they tell you to make every second count, you should believe them. Because moments pass before you realize it, and you'll want to hold on to what you've got. Not everyone gets an encore, but sometimes the memories get to speak for themselves. And sometimes, that's enough.